a 14-year-old who had been sexually abused by Jeffrey Epstein, was publicly told she committed a crime in front of a grand jury back in 2006. According to newly released court transcripts obtained by RadarOnline.com, Epstein had inappropriately touched the unnamed teenager and then paid her $300 to give him a massage at his home in Palm Beach, Flo. Prosecutor Lana Bielalovic also reportedly took photos and other information from the minor's personal social media to smear her reputation to the court. The images show the 14-year-old drinking and in simulated sexual situations. During the criminal proceedings, one of the jurors asked her if she had any idea, deep down inside that what she was doing with Epstein had been wrong. The girl admitted that she did feel that way. The juror also asked her if she'd set the goal not to ever do that again, and if she was now aware of what she was doing to her own reputation with her actions. The victim agreed. Bielalovic then cut in, you're aware that you committed a crime? The girl, who was 16 years old at the time of the questioning, replied, now I am. I didn't know it was a crime when I was doing it. On a Monday, July 1st, interview with CBS 12, the lawyer who represented the teenager at the time suggested Bielalovic to be embarrassed to see the information that was released in the court transcripts regarding her behavior to the young abuse victim. They were trying to avoid a prosecution of a clear rape of a minor, Spencer Coven continued. And the only reason that they were likely doing it at the time is because they were afraid of Epstein's defense team. As OK previously reported, Epstein was arrested again in July 2019 and faced charge for the trafficking of minors in both Florida and New York. However, shortly before he was set to face trial, the disgraced financier was found dead in his jail cell. In July 2020, his former girlfriend and partner in crime, Elaine Maxwell, was arrested and charged with six felony counts, including trafficking of a minor. She was found guilty of five out of six charges. Maxwell is currently serving out her 20-year sentence at Federal Correctional Institution of Tallahassee in Florida.